All right, guys. Got a got contacted by Clinger Holsters. Um, if you've seen my er earlier videos on the Clinger Comfort um, tuckable holster, it's just a really uh, comfortable material that you don't even it doesn't even use retention clips. It just uh, tucks in your waistband and kind of sticks to your skin. Hence the clinger name it clings to you but they had contacted me and said they had a new product they wanted me to check out and I said sure send it you know I do if uh, you know how I like to do things if they if it's a product I like I'll let you know about it if not I'll give my honest opinion on it but it's always nice when they give you some uh, man swag I don't know something about putting a sticker in something that just gives you a little extra joy. I cling to my God-given rights. Cling holster. Pretty nice addition. But on to the product itself. It is the uh, Clinger Cushion. And basically what it is is it's a pad. comes with an al alcohol pad to clear your holster and multiple velcro dots so you can attach it to multiple holsters and then you have a comfort pad this is made to go up against your you has a velcro side that you put the dots you attach them to your holster Here's for G23. Basically, you just attach it to the holster like so, and it's supposed to give you a really um, comfortable, almost like a gel filled pad up against your skin to make it a little bit more comfortable. It's really not been a problem on some of the holsters I have, but. That's one holster here for the uh, G27. Kind of got a really greedy texture on the Kydex. And uh, <clears throat> might come in very handy on that. So what I'm gonna do is we're gonna put that one on the uh, G23. Then we'll put this one on the G27 and I'll try them out. I'll rotate them out. You know how I usually do. I'll, I'll take a product, a holster or something and try it out for at least a week. Um, so I'll rotate between the G27 up here and the G23. And let you know how it goes. Alright, let's go ahead and put it on and see how it's, it should be pretty easy. Nice, they come with alcohol pads already in it. We'll just clean the outside of the holster. Like so. Give it a little bit of time to evaporate and then we'll just attach our dots onto it let that sit just a little bit and Evaporate off and then we'll attach our dots. Alright, the one thing I will say, I like to add multiple dots in there so you can uh, add them to multiple different holsters. Um, 
basically it's just a it's like a neoprene velcro on one side and it's kind of got like a cushiony pad material and you just add it to it like I said we'll we'll carry each one of these independently for a week and I'll give you my honest feedback on how they feel. It seems like it should be really straightforward. Seems like it should be really straightforward. Just add a little uh, padding on the outside where it contacts your skin. Some people may be irritated with the the material of the holster. But we'll see how it goes. I'll let you know. Um, I think it's a pretty cool product. Uh, good to try it out and I'll get back to you. Like I said, I will say on the adhesive of these, you might want to warm them up really good. Make sure they get really good and stuck. A little, a little cool up here in my man cave winter time so there we go they're not coming off now all right got the velcro dots installed one good thing about these pads are is they're washable so if you get them dirty they get sweaty stinky uh, you can wash them let them uh, lay flat to dry and you can also change them between multiple holsters. So, if you need any more dots, you can just order them. So there's the one for the 27. And this is my most favorite holster. So, even if you don't necessarily have a Clinger holster. You can add this to any any of your existing holsters. So we'll go with that and see how that runs. Let you know what I think of it. Yes, yeah, so <clears throat> I think they're going to be pretty good um, little additions to holsters. Um, if you're interested in some of these, you can go on their website, Clinger. Um, I think these run for about $19 uh, as of the time I made this video. Um, uh, I think it might help out some folks, especially if you've got you know holsters. Some of these holsters we pay $50, $60, $70 dollars for and get them and then hey some of them are not as comfortable as others and you hate to be throwing your money away so you might be able to make a life a little bit more pleasant carrying because if we know the more comfortable you can be carrying the more you're going to cut more you're going to carry so um i think it'll be really good addition the dots staying on all right now make sure you go check them out um, I will like I said I'll test them for a week and let you know how they go